Peekaboo? Hello. Hey. I came to visit because we haven't talked in a bit. How you doing? Yeah. Uh, I've been better. Did something happen? Yep. Um. Pretty big. You want to talk about it? You really want to hear about it? I mean, I'm not the greatest therapist, but I can try. Uh, so, I got sent on a quest to prove my worth, I guess, mm -hmm. by Ruda and my trust. And let's just say I had to help a village who yeah. was already in shambles. I had to rescue their family members from a cult. All the oh. oh, well, the majority of them were dead and were drowned. Ooh. And so I had to put them to rest. The cult was not there. I had to go back and tell them. Ooh. And I was asked to leave because they needed time to grieve. The next day, I decided to go back and visit, you know, because I felt bad and bring them food. Because they said they were also running low on crops. And what do I find? That everyone's dead. Uh, I have a feeling I know what village you're talking about. So you were there with Rex when he went? He, yeah. They came back. They killed my daddy. I'm scared. They're chasing me. Mommy, daddy, someone help. Oh, That's shit. the little girl. I mean, she's still alive, but we I don't know if she's captured or not. Should we go to the village and check? I, 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 I could, but I, I searched all around there the first day. Maybe... Hmm. Maybe she's hiding somewhere? I, I... I hope that's the case. I mean, she wrote that book. I would hope she's still alive. I, I hope so, too. But in the book, you also read that, you know, they were coming after her. Hmm. Well, maybe there's still time captured. to save her. I guess, yeah, yeah. We should uh, go. We we don't know how much time we have left. You're right. You're, you're right. I gotta do something. Kayla? Oh. Is she that... seems injured. She's Is hurt. that her? What? Please help me. Kayla, are you okay? Can you hear me? I just, it hurts. Please help me, mister. How can I help? We need help. We need to go get help. She's passed out. Okay, uh, should we take her somewhere safe? Or? I, I, I know someone who could help, I think. In the, the village I think you've been to before. Potion Master could, could help. Potion master. Is it? I don't remember if I've seen Ruda master. or Spirit, whatever they go by. Ruda. I remember seeing Ruda. I don't know how we're going to keep her safe. I can't really pick her up and move her. She's an NPC. Oh, yeah. Um, I think, well, you have walls. I think she'll hopefully be okay. True. All right, let's go. We gotta act quick or she's gonna, you know, maybe perish. I know she's a computer, but if you would have seen what the cult did, I don't think any, even a computer should suffer that. Ruda? Uh, I, I need your help. Uh, it's slave, what, 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 what's happening? Do you know the village? Right, the one that you sent me after? Yeah, what's up? You know how there were still people within it? Not everyone was dead? Yeah. I went back the other day and the cult had basically destroyed and killed everyone. And there was a book, a trail of blood leading to a book where the little girl in the village basically gone away. And when Marshy and I went upstairs from our volcano to go see if we could find her, she was there lying. 
She's unconscious now, but she needs help. I, I she, need your help. Is she alive? Is she fine? Like, is, well, fine is an overstatement, but like... She's pretty beaten up. I, she needs okay. medical help. Let's go. Alright, this way. I sure hope whatever you have is good enough. Well, I'll have to inspect her first and see if my potions actually, you know, can do something. This is all the village, I believe, has left. This is one little girl. What about her father? Oh, God. Dead. Inside their home was a skull. The majority of the people where they were last I was was their skull. There was a few that were just missing, though. Oh, I'm hoping that some are also still alive. I'm trying to remember. I think I've passed that village multiple times before, you know. Just on errands. Um, is she inside, maybe? Yes, oh. she is. She is very beaten up. Okay. Um says it hurts. Shit, hold up. Please tell me you can do something. Anything. We might have to move again. AKA Where? I could try, but I highly doubt that my potions will do anything. And the only other person that I can think of that could help is someone that you probably don't want to talk to. Hmm? Is that really all we have left is pity from the fucking god? It's there not has pity. There's some way to save her other way. <sighs> Can't be indebted to the damn god. Okay, well, how about you stand back? I can try? Like I said, I doubt that it would work, but... Just, just try, please. Yep. Nothing? Is that... is that better? Fuck. Still not looking too Okay. Weird. All candy here. I can't... I can't just call upon her. I... One of you, you both have some kind of Candy, connection. Candy, if you're Candy. listening, we could use your help. I'm not usually the one who calls her. She's usually the one who finds me. And in this situation, we should be the ones to find her. AKA, we need to go to her village. That's so far away. It's far away, but that's the last thing that we can do. Okay. Well, if that's all we can do, let's let's do it. Should, any, should, should we stay with her? Like, should someone stay with her? Or do you guys know the the way uh, to the village? I know the way. Could you stay with her? We'll we'll go. Yeah, sure. Well, Marcy. We'll be quick, or try to, anyways. So, what do you plan on doing with the? A girl. Just making sure she's alright and safe. I don't know what I'm gonna do with her. I guess she could stay with me in the volcano until we save the rest of the village and stop the cult. I don't know if that's the best place for her. Yeah, it's and I don't my think volcano. my tree is very child friendly. No, considering one, one. kind of jumped off and missed the and landing. That one, was a, that one seems to come back every time. <laughs> we could... What about... Vanguard. I don't know what your relationship with them is. Maybe. It's kind of just on the water. It would be safe, but it's really far from where I am. I'm thinking maybe asking or begging Ruta for a home within the village. She can stay in. The, yeah, the, the village would be probably the safest, actually. Yeah, no, it doesn't even have to be my home, just a place for the kid to stay. I, f 
finally made it, but this... Hmm? Is this really something I can do? Can I really expect myself to beg at her feet? I'd rather die myself than do such a thing. Kayla, I really have to push away my pride. I hate this. This is the worst. Oh. I wish it didn't come to this. Oops. I'm gonna have to. Knock, knock. Anyone home? <sighs> oh, that's I one way to open doors. the door. What? What? Um, we what need you doing here. Please help. I'm what? begging you. I need you to help someone. They're they're dying, and we've tried everything, and you're our last hope. You're begging me. I am begging you. Please. Uh, please help. Please? There's a <sighs> child who's hurt. It's the girl from the village. I've seen what's become of it, and she found her way to my volcano. Please help her. Stand up, just tell me more about it on our way there. All right. People just... of that village, I saw what happened, both before and after. This cold sickens me. But you said they drowned people? They did, for using magic. That's... that's fucked up. I had to be the one to put those drowned people to rest a second time. Yikes. And then I had to tell the families about it. Even the worst back. person shouldn't go through that. Not even a computer should have to go through that. Can't be certain that she is a computer anymore. What do you mean by that? It's taken me some time to get to grips with the fact that you people are changing things. I used to know everything that went on in this world, and now there are more and more NPCs that have emotions and pain, and so many of them are popping up nowadays. This isn't the first time it's happened either. There's two that live in Vanguard, and, and then there's Callum even though he's been around since the beginning. Do you know where this cult is, where they reside? No. I didn't even know they existed until Ruta told me anything. Like I said, things in this world are changing, and sometimes for the better, and now seemingly for the worse. The enemies are getting smarter, and the NPCs are getting more human. And I don't know why. I've met Callum. You've met Callum? What? He arrived at my volcano. We had a bit of a conversation, and he left me with two things to give to both groups, Library and Vanguard. Where did he go? He disappeared. I Damn don't it. know where he went, but he seemed injured. He said he's always watching. Leave it to him to be so cliché. One of these days, I will find him and kill him. Once and for all. I gave a book to the library in Vanguard about... I don't know. Apparently he knew that ZK didn't believe that he was sentient. And he wrote him a whole book talking about his sentience. He's clever. Like I said. Way smarter than any normal person, because he was programmed to be that way. But he's not without his own weaknesses. I hope we make it in time. I think Ruta should be taking care of her. I think she'll be fine. Yeah, but Ruta also said she couldn't do anything. The potions did nothing. You've already tried all of Ruta's potions, huh? Yep. We even pulled her from her village to come help us, and nothing could help is why we had to come to you. I don't want to leave this innocent girl 
and let her die when her both her parents don't exist anymore. Yeah, because when an NPC dies, they just cease to exist. I thought that that was a luxury that only Callum would have, but it seems not. It seems that the more NPCs that are becoming so sentient are getting the same characteristics about them. They're getting emotions. They're moving away from what they were programmed to do. And yeah, we can assume based on that that this little girl, if she is really as sentient as she seems, only has one life. Well, let's not let this... Let's let her keep it. Yeah. I'm, I'm praying that she does. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. Depending on what I have to do once I see the situation. As long as she's living. That's all I care. Good to hear. Because there are some results that you might not like. Oh. I tried to fix it. Pick up your things, Ruta. Let me have a look. And I was afraid it would come to this. Come to what? I can do something that will almost certainly save her. But like I said, you're not exactly going to like the result. What I'm going to have to ask that you all give me some time in private. Oh, okay. Just please, whatever it takes. Whatever the cost, I'll pay it. No need. She'll be okay. Are you okay? I... I threw away my pride. Okay. You she's gonna live. Whatever it takes, right? Whatever it takes, true. Not easy to throw away your pride, so... As long as she lives, I will, I will defend her, her parents, and her legacy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This cult, they're gonna die. I will make sure they pay for every life they took, every childhood they took. This cult will pay. Mm -hmm. well, do we have Ru any leads on where they would be? This cult? Mm, no, not that I know of. Hmm. Well, they were they were last seen to the west. That's the only lead that I think we have, unless we In found the something village else. Is the last outpost I've scene with the cult uh ruda speaking yeah. of the situation she's gonna need a place to stay my volcano isn't really the best spot and i've offered my tree but that's probably not safe either i was gonna ask if you know you had somewhere in the village that she could stay yeah if it's for my child, I'm okay with letting her stay. There's a lot of uninhabited um, houses in my village, so... Thank you. Oh. Oh. What is going on in there? Apparently what's necessary. Okay. Andy? Yeah. <coughs> Is she gonna be alright? I'll be fine. She just needs some time to rest. Thank you. 
what's wrong with her skin? What do I have to do? Before it... Too bad, I should probably... Give me a moment. She'll need that. What's it for? So that her undead half doesn't burn in the sun. In order to save her, the only thing I can do was... make her partially undead. Well, at least she can live. It'll keep her alive, probably longer than she wants to live. But she'll never age, and she can't be in direct sunlight. Okay. The helmet will protect her from areas like this, but not for too long. I, um... Thank Are you. you okay? Please take that. I'll be fine. Hey, how about we don't crowd her? That's not gonna help. Maybe no more magic for a bit. I don't choose to use magic. The situation just seems to come up. Um... I, um, need to take a quick break. And there she goes. She's gonna be alright. She'll be okay. She'll... So, she can't we be in sunlight. Probably. Do you have anything to cover her from the sun for now? Uh, let me look. I probably have some extra leather hide somewhere. If anything, we can build her a, a small <clears throat> roof. Yeah, a small little tent. I don't want to move her while she's, you know... Unconscious. Unconscious, yeah. yeah. If she wakes up in a place that she's not familiar with, that'll just scare her. Probably. I don't have a whole lot of wool, but I have stone. I have... I... I mean... That'll keep her, keep her cool. That should work for now. I... Situation. I... Thank you, both of you. For coming to my aid. I needed it most. That's yeah. what friends are for. Yeah, that's what friends are for. I think you should really thank uh, can Candy. I gave her a lot of gold. Think of it as an offering. <laughs> That's something that she's not going to get from me very often. Unless a situation like this arises. Yeah. It's... Maybe while she's oh. resting, maybe you could show me to the house that she'll be staying in. Oh, I mean, if you would like to help pick out a house, there's a few, but... I'd, I'd love to. Um, alright. Um, Marshy. Hmm. How about we go check up Andy? I... She's been talking to you a lot, at least that's um, where I'm... If I can find her, yeah, I will. Okay, she's honestly probably somewhere... Just laying down. Yeah. Okay, just take care of her for me, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, All right. Pick out the cutest toss for her. <laughs> I will. Well, whatever my definition of cute is. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hello? Um. Hello? Uh. You good? Uh, what? <laughs> oh shit. Whoa, 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 Don't, 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 just don't, just don't. 
Is that because of the flux? Don't just... Don't worry about it. <sighs> okay. You... Okay? At least? I'm... Fine. I just... Fine. Didn't, um... Didn't expect you to be there, or for... I guess, for me to collapse here. No? You're free to collapse in my tree whenever you need to. I'm not gonna judge you for, you know, being human. Just got tired is all. It's nothing. That's perfectly fine. If you need to rest, you can. Um. Is, uh, the girl gonna be fine? Yeah. They're getting her a house in Brutus Village. That's something. I don't... I'm not trying to use magic. I honestly hate magic. I just... The situation just... calls for it sometimes. Yeah? When it does, you have to do what you have to do. You have to make choices that you don't want to make, and you have to... Do things that you don't want to do. Yeah. We don't really have a choice sometimes, but if it's for the greater good or whatever, then I think it's worth it, maybe. About, um, about what you, uh, saw, I guess. Yeah. About this. Is that from Flux? Well, it's complicated. But, um, partially, yes. In other ways, not completely. I, um, guess you could say experimented a bit with things that I shouldn't have. It's it. It's not taint, is it? Remember what I told you about when um, you use flux abilities or you incorporate flux into your life so much that it corrupts you? So is it warp? It's called corruption. It's a type of physical taint. Most of the time, taint just goes on the ground or whatever, but Sometimes it messes with you. I see. And sure, it comes with warp. I mean, I, I should probably say I'm fine now. I'm not warped or anything. I luckily know how to get rid of warp, but you can't get rid of corruption. Oh. It's, um... Does it hurt? Well, difficult to explain. It's not exactly comfortable, which I guess isn't really um something that you want to hear, but it's fine. It's uh complicated. Like A lot I said, of things are complicated. Definitely doesn't make magic easier. I'll just tell you that. Yeah. Is that Definitely why you wear the trade. mask? Well, it's not exactly the thing that you want to wake up and see in the morning in your nice, pretty world that you're supposed to be the ruler of, is it? I guess that's fair, yeah. Masks are cool. <laughs> Maybe I'll start wearing a mask. They could be masked. Don't copy cool. my style. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I like you without a mask. Um, just you know, I mask wouldn't suit you. Fair. Should add more books to your library. I haven't found any. Well, maybe you need to start finding more. There. Well, I guess. I guess I could go 
from exploring more often. But I don't really know where to look for books necessarily. We don't really have a library yet. If you need to, I could keep you a book or two. Uh, I mean, since books aren't OP, I wouldn't mind. They're just books in the end. Yeah, right. They're not, like, anything important, so they shouldn't really matter, right? Yeah. But, uh... Do that in a bit. I just... Uh... Yeah, just... Just... Rest for as long as you need 